It was an emotional scene in Victoria. Police from across the province joined complete strangers to honour the fallen. All of us, every single one of us, want to go home at the end of our shift, to, to home to our loved ones and home to our family. And I think that it, officers are thinking about that. The recent death of Constable O'Brien weighed heavy on the minds of many. It's been a difficult year for police in BC with the death of Shaylin Yang not even a year ago. Her name was unveiled on the memorial at the Bastion. Next year, Rick O'Brien's name will join hers. The RCMP lost an officer, but the community also lost a friend and protector, and that can hit home for a lot of us, knowing all the good things they try to do to keep us safe. There's a lot of heavy hearts and um, people that are really hurting, and it just kind of plays into how important these days are. A hero remembered is never forgotten, and everything that we do is for those people that lost their lives. The memorial honours 130 law enforcement officers who have made the ultimate sacrifice serving BC communities. All the names of the deceased were read aloud, dating back to the 1800s. Memorial services were held across Canada. Just to hear some of the words, it really puts into perspective how challenging the profession can be and the fact that people can go to work and there's no guarantee that they may go home to their families, which is everyone deserves to have that. This year, 11 officers have passed away in the line of duty in Canada. A grim new record. Claire Palmer, CBC News, Victoria.